Hi Crazy Potters, it's such a lovely day today. I'm in a sundress, can't believe it. How beautiful is this? Anyway, what I'm here to do today is I'm going to show you a few of the things that I made a little while ago that are in my cupboard that I can't bear to get rid of. So maybe you can tell me whether you like them or not. There's a couple of other things as well, which I'll just show you. Oh, here he is. He's my wall jumper. He's crazy. Love him. And also we've got a little giraffe. This is Claude. I'm going to hold him up because it's easier because it's a bit bright. Oh, can I hold him up? Yay. Oh, look at us. It's me, Claude. Yay. Um, he was one of the first few sculptures I did. Actually, I think he was probably the very... <laughs> The very first sculpture I did. So <clears throat> he's kind of a, the original one. Actually, is upstairs. He was he came second, but he's ex the one upstairs is exactly the same, except he's made out of air dry clay. He was the first fired one I did, and I really just loved them. There was a couple of others. I don't know if you've seen them on the shop. Um, I did a few other bits and pieces. Did you see the dog in the Superman outfit? crazy people out there that's what they wanted but there you go so here we go i'm going to show you a few other things as well we're going to have a look in my cupboard <gasps> here we go so i tend to keep do i no yeah i keep all the odd bits and pieces so i've got a cupboard full of mugs that are all don't work or not got a handle that's straight or um the glaze has all dripped off the bottom or there's a chunk out of it or I'll get all the best stuff. But there are some things that I keep because I just like. And these, this is my white cupboard. I don't know if you can see that. And I've got another one over there. So I collect white china. I don't really collect it. I just love it. Um, so luckily I've been able to make some of my own. So here's a few things. Here's my lovely heart-shaped bowl with a spoon. Why did I do a spoon? I have no idea. But I made a load of spoons. Oh, I could show you my spoons as well. I did loads of spoons. So this is my serving little serving bowl. Could be for dips. Could be for... What do you need a spoon for? Stuff. Just anything. Anything. Then I did this. This is my little, it's called a berry bowl. So when you get up in the morning and you, you just have your berries in your cereal, it's just a little, little colander just for those few berries. Mine's in the cupboard so I don't use it. Bad, my bad. Okay, um, but I love those. I've got a few of those in somewhere. I can't remember. I know Amore Therapies has got one for sale. Um, then this is my brie camembert baker thing. I put it in there and then I bake it in the oven. <gasps> nice, it's got a nice little design on the top. That's nice, I like that. And I kind of like that style because I don't know if you can see at the back there, but let's move that out of the way. But I've got the platters as well. So a couple of platters in there with the nice handles. A few people have ordered those. It's basically the same as the one I did the wedding, the wedding gift with the two mugs. So that's pretty similar to that. This is one of my odd ones that I decided to keep. It was a mug. I squished it by accident. What did I do? <gasps> Turned it into a square, oval, round jug and carved it. Don't know what shape it is. Um, okay, so then what else have we got? Oh. oh, this is another one of my odd ones. This is my wobbly bowl. And actually, I love how it came out. It's kind of a wobble pot that went wrong on the potter's wheel but I kept oh, <laughs> dropped it kept it anyway 
Let's not ask for serving. See? Just goes to show that's what people call art. Even if it's a bit wobbly. Um, what have I got? I've got a, I'm going to let you have a look. I've got a big sort of bowl, serving bowl there. Smaller bowl. A few things, a few things. On my table, I've got my little plant holder. I don't know if you can see that. I'm really bad at this, aren't I? Anyway, if you can't see it, sorry, it was really nice. Um, what else have we got? Oh, here's my colander. My bigger colander. I did the berry bowl, but this is a bigger colander. So don't forget, guys, if you want any of this sort of stuff, just fax me. There you go. Everybody needs a colander. You can have it whatever size you like, except don't go too big because I'm not very good at too big stuff yet. I'll give it a go. Anyway, what else have I got down here? Spoons. Look at this bad boy. I've got a whole dish of them. Look at this bad boy. Ooh, ooh the slotted spoon. Kind of wonky, but that's why I keep them. I've got a whole bowl of them. This one's kind of good. This one's kind of good. It's testing. See? All good stuff. Anyway, the sun is very bright today, as you can see, and I'm about to go and sit in my garden, have a nice cup of tea, have my lunch, and then I'm going back to building goblets that was precarious precarious yesterday i made a whole load of goblets put them on the side um oh i bet everybody feels sick by now because i've just been moving around really a lot but anyway um made a load of goblets put them on the side came downstairs had my lunch sat in the sun because it was lovely what happened bloody window flew open Okay, I admit, I left the window open and the wind blew and knocked my tablet holder off, flattened all my pots, all my goblet tops. I was just annoyed. But anyway, I got over it because you have to, these things happen. So what I'm doing today is I'm going to put the bottoms on i'm putting the bottoms on the two actually two of them that got squished cut the tops off and turned them into just nice little round ones you'll see those coming up shortly and then we've got some other ones some taller ones some shorter ones i'm making some muglets what are muglets you say it's a mug with a let on the bottom just like a gob let anyway that's my surprise thing coming up. Keep an eye out for those. I'm going now, but we will be back in the next video. See you guys. Happy potting. Oh, I just went happy potting.